You head the King's Way yet? Certainly. There is something, but it involves a gargoyle. Hmm, I can see that's got your attention. It's taken up residence in my beloved Asian theater. It is closed now, but that's beside the point. I sent some people to evict it, and it sent them back with a few less limbs. I can't have that monster attacking Kindred in my city. It's a walking block of stone with a taste for blood. I'd suggest whatever method doesn't result in you being eviscerated. In truth, I'd rather have it as an ally, but I doubt it's going to be chatty. Here's the key for the theater. I'll leave it up to you. Certainly. In your lifetime, unwittingly or not, you have seen an Isaac Abrams production. As the financier of 30% of American film's top 100 movies, you must have. Being the Baron of Hollywood, I can do any project I want. Stewart, Lean, Hitchcock, Wilder, Holden, Dean, Scorsese, De Niro, and last but not least, Ash, my child. I remember some studio suit lost in time telling me the only thing they could use Bogart for was to move furniture. Ash, where do I begin? Seven years ago, I saw a casting session for what would become Negative Zero. The moment I set eyes on him, the passion of his performance, I knew he had it. I hadn't seen anything like him since Cliff or Dean. He had the looks, the charisma, the lure, that undefinable quality that makes a film legend. My first movie with him made him a sensation, and it also changed him. I acted on impulse. I had seen so many others die before their time, but with Ash, I had a chance to prevent that fate. It devastated Ash. He still wanted to act, but I denied him his place in the limelight. He had to lie to his friends about his new lifestyle. He had to feed. I gave him a club, a scrap of his former glory. I did everything I could to facilitate the change. He feels obligated to me. I don't think he hates me. Resents me, maybe. I am his sire, and he is my child. There is a responsibility and respect inherent in that bond, even if we are no longer the friends we were. He spends nearly all of his nights in his club, the asp hole. I am, I admit it, too old-fashioned to appreciate it. To me, it's the compressed essence of everything that's wrong with the film industry today. 